Hi, I'm the UI lead of Dead Space 3. I'm here to show you guys a really awesome feature we've been working on for quite a while. It's called the Weapon Bench. You'll be able to build guns, modify guns, share guns. It's pretty crazy. Check it out. We always wanted to show Isaac as a true engineer. Um, he's resourceful, he's smart, and he's good at building things. The bench was always an attempt at showing this. Case in point, the plasma cutter was always a mining tool originally used for cutting boulders, and he somehow refashioned it to be his primary weapon. Uh, in the original Dead Space, you were able to add nodes to your weapons to improve them and upgrade them. You would follow the upgrade trees to make, let's say, the reload much faster or the gun much stronger. In Dead Space 2, we actually even went as far as starting the game with him building his first weapon out of a flashlight and a surgical tool. We looked at what we did in Dead Space 1 and 2, and the bench, as awesome as it was, we found ways to naturally progress to this new version in Dead Space 3. We've completely rebuilt the bench from the ground up. Not only can you upgrade your existing weapons, you can actually build your weapons from scratch. Pick a frame, say we want the heavy frame, and then we decide what we want as an engine. Let's say we want a Tesla core engine, which creates like electricity that comes out of the gun. And we decide that, okay, so on that gun, primary adapter, which is the tip of the gun, we can decide what kind of electricity tip we have or use. We've got all these different ones. Let's say we want this one. And then for the secondary engine, we can decide to make the bottom one, say, make fire, how's that? There you go. I like that gun, let's build it. Um, so electricity on top, fire on the bottom. Build it. Do you want a single-handed gun or two-handed gun? You got it. You want a plasma cutter engine, you want a Tesla coil engine, you want a ripper core engine, you got it. You want a ripper core on top with a plasma cutter in the bottom, boom, you got it. How about flaming bullets? Or how about flaming rip cores? You can do all that, all on the new bench. The possibilities are endless. We approach the redesign knowing that we will have hardcore fans who will want to build their guns and tweak their guns to the most intricate of details. We gave them the ability to do this and made sure it was equally easy to drill down and build new weapons as it was to modify old ones. And for those who want to build guns in one click, we've got a system for that too. Blueprints are schematics that allow you to build guns in one click. You just go down the list, find the gun you want, and boom, you've got it. So on uh, Jesus and Mary chain gun, hot death. So if you wanted to build a plasma cutter, all you really needed is to have the resources to do it. And it looks here that I do. So I go, boom, let's build it. And then he says, okay, well, let's put it here. And now he's building it. And then you step out over there, and then you literally have that gun ready. There's a dude, I wanna kill him. In co-op, if you built a really cool gun, you can easily share your blueprint to your co-op partner so they can build too.